Okay, let's see if this works. Hello, hello. Okay, it looks like I'm live. Um, let's see if this works. I'm going to wait a minute for you guys to get in here. So I'm coming over here from Twitch. Um, I was having some issues this morning or today, I guess, with Twitch um, dropping frames really poorly. Looks like I've got a great connection here on YouTube. Hello, everybody. So I'm starting to think it might be a Twitch problem. And if so, maybe I'll still start try to set up dual streaming on Twitch and YouTube. But that way we can switch. Like you can switch if Twitch starts dropping frames or something like that. Um, hello, everybody. So yeah, it looks like I've got a good connection here and we're going to find out if this is a Twitch problem or if this is my internet problem. Um, I'm kind of thinking it might be a Twitch problem. <laughs> and if so, what I might do is go ahead and um, open up memberships on here so people can sub on YouTube, but I don't have that feature right now. Um, because I just had to hurry up and get over here. And let me pop out chat. And I don't know if my mods are mods on this channel either. I don't know. One second. Get, get where I want you to go. Get where I want you to go. So what we're going to do is play, finish playing our dreamers. So there's going to be part one of this stream um, that I did on Twitch. And then part two I'm doing here on YouTube. And both of them will be archived here. Uh, I am trying to get my chat window up. It's real. YouTube chat window is like not, does not cooperate with me for some reason. I can't pop it in. All right, I'm just going to sit it right here. Okay. All right, so we're going to go ahead and get ready and play. And I'm going to keep an eye on my connection, but everything seems to be great so far. Nope, it's dropping a little bit. It's dropping a little bit. Nope, it's back up. Okay. It's very frustrating for me, and I'm sorry. It's It's got to be frustrating for you guys, too. I'm so sorry. I just want to be able to play and stream. Oh, I don't know why I'm having so many issues. But thank you guys so much for joining. And uh, let, I'm going to go ahead and get us into the game now so we can get to playing. Just keep my little stream window up there. Okay, so let's move over into the game. There we go. You're gray like other mortals. Oh my gosh, I wonder if I can make you a, a mod. Oops. Come here, Nathan. You're running away. You're running away from me. Come back. Um, there you go. Um, there you go, Nathan. I made you a mod. So you should show up as a mod now. Okay, so we're back in the game. Yeah, I have perfect quality connection now. So this does lead me to believe that I've had the internet people out here all this time and it's been a Twitch problem the whole time. And I, I'm going to try to contact Twitch and be like, hey, I'm dropping frames every stream. What the hell? And when I stream on YouTube, it's fine. So maybe they can like look into my account and see. I don't know. <laughs> Not gray, Nathan. <laughs> Nathan's blue now. So here we are back in the dreamer household. Oh my gosh. We can finally. Nope. See, it's dropping. Shoot. I think it is me. I think it is me. <laughs> no, it's back up. Okay, whatever. I'm just going to play. Let's hope for the best. Um, all right. So what I was trying to do is get Darren to order a pizza, but I think it didn't work. Maybe because I had NPCC in my game. I don't know. So I took NPCC out and we're going to try to order a pizza again. Okay, it's good. All right. Maybe that was just a little slight variation. All right. So we're going to go to phone and home and um, order a delivery. No, not groceries. Oops. Oh, will it not let me order a pizza? A pizza's already on its way? Okay. Where is it? I ordered it like an hour ago. Where's my pizza? I see no pizza person. Where are you, pizza delivery person? I don't see. I don't think we're getting a pizza, y'all. I don't think... Because it still thinks a pizza's on the way. Wait, who's that? Who's that? No. 
That's Pal Melon. He's everywhere we go. He's everywhere. He's just doing some stretching here. There's Nina. Also doing some stretching in the rain. Where's my loose toppings? I need my loose pizza toppings. They're not coming, y'all. Okay, so Darren's gonna have to do something he hates. Maybe he could just get a quick meal or something. Uh, they do have a microwave, so I'm gonna have him do a microwave meal. How about how about you have a pepperoni pizza roll up for dinner, and then Dirk, um, you can get. Oh no, he's going to mourn his mother's grave. Okay, that's sad. That's sad. He's going to mourn his mother's grave. Well, I took NPCC out, but I think because it was already, like, initiated, it's still screwed up. Yeah. Aw, he's mourning. Hello, Kayla. Welcome back, everybody. I got a strong connection on YouTube. That sucks. I really- I love streaming on Twitch, man. We have all our sound alerts and everything over there. There's obviously something wrong with my Twitch. Hello, darkness, my old friend. <laughs> okay, that's just sad. We gotta get come in here and eat some microwave food. That'll cheer you up. Nothing cheers me up more than uh, instant noodles. No, chicken nuggets. Or what, what else do we have? Pizza rolls. It only costs a dollar for pizza rolls. Come on. Oh, where's Hendrick? There you are, Hendrick. Yes, Twitch is also more moderator friendly. I agree. It's just it's just a better streaming pa uh, platform. Uh, hold up here. Let me get let me make you a mod. Get those pizza rolls, boy. Okay, there you go. You should be mod now. All right, great. Pizza. I want some pizza. I want some loose toppings. Dang, I think I want to order some loose toppings for dinner. You can order it from Papa John's. They just have pizza bowls without the crust and you could just, I just get like all the meats in there. <laughs> Dirk is good. Okay, so it's like 9.43 at night, so I think it's time for bed. You gotta go to school tomorrow and Darren, you gotta paint some more tomorrow. So let's go to bed and then we'll pretty much be done with the dreamers. I'm going to get them through the night so that when we move over to the Pleasant household, it'll be in the morning. <laughs> yes, it's working perfectly here on YouTube, so I don't know. It does really suck that YouTube won't invest more into streaming. It could, it could be just as good as Twitch. It definitely could be. What I'm thinking I might do is set up dual streaming so I can stream on both Twitch and YouTube at the same time. That way if Twitch, that way people can choose their platform to watch me on and if Twitch starts screwing up, you could just go to YouTube and we don't have to do this whole shutting down the stream thing. And I can enable um, subs on both. So I think that's what I'm going to try to do for next week. Oh, it's the spring equinox. Okay, we'll be celebrating that with the fan, with the, uh, with the Pleasant family. So this is one of my custom, um, wow. This is one of my custom holidays that I do. No, multi-streaming shouldn't cause issues because basically I stream to, I'm going to use probably Restream. So I stream to Restream and then it, it directs the stream onto both platforms. So it shouldn't be a problem um, unless there's a Twitch connection problem. Yes, and Twitch did change their policy so partners are allowed to do multi-streaming. Yes, they did. I, I uh, looked into that. So it's it's totally okay to do it. Um, okay, so yeah, Spring Equinox is my holiday. So there's Egg Hunt, Flower Bunny, and Grand Meal. So I guess we'll have to do that at the Pleasants. Man, it's going to be a sad Spring Equinox for the Pleasants. And that also means Mary Sue is going to be off off work. That sucks. Should I? Maybe I should cancel the spring equinox or move it because this is really going to get in the way of our scripted events here. Yes, Twitch partners can now multi-stream. Twitch changed their policies. Um. 
You can set it so they can go to work. That's true. Is it too late, though? Okay, so I, I changed it so they can go to school and work. So maybe that will fix our problems. Okay, hold up. It's 6-11. I'm going to go ahead and save and we're going to move over to the Pleasant Household and see what we can do. Yeah, I chose for them to go to work, so hopefully it's not too late. Um, I did think about staying with the Dreamers another day. I don't know. Let's just go. Let's. I want to go do it. I want to go do it. So let's go to Save and Manage Worlds. We could do that Mary Sue's busy with family, yeah. Let's see if it if it's too late if it was too late or if it's gonna let them go to work. Let's go in here and see what's going down. Alright. 215 Sim Lane. Well, I haven't really played a lot with the Growing Together features yet, I am Audi. Um, I've only one thing that I love about it is the milestones or memories. I mean, I, I, 10 out of 10 on that. Because I love having these memories. Um, or what they call milestones. It's awesome. So, I love that. But I haven't really played with, like, the infants and stuff yet. So, it's, I can't tell you yet until we get an infant. Which is probably going to be Brandy Broke's baby first. Mary would be definitely working on holidays, yeah. Um, okay, so just a, a look at our family real quick. Um, Daniel, you need to get here. Bring Daniel Pleasant here. Okay, Daniel, the father of the family. It's early in the morning. So it's dark, so you can barely see him. Um, I didn't get the Milestone Expanded mod yet. Um, I need to do that. I'm sorry. I didn't really do any Sim stuff this past week because I've been having, like, some... Things going on in my personal life, so I didn't get a lot of Sim stuff done. But it's on my list of things to do. Okay, so... Daniel is materialistic, romantic, active. He's a mediator. He has a tinkering hobby. He's ripped, yeah. He's a neutral about having children. He is a romance Sim. He's alluring. He's a lover. And he's a hero. So his milestones, of course, um, he got promoted, he had his first woohoo, he had his daughters, and he got a degree in biology and started his first job. Of course, he got married to Mary Sue, but he also fell in love with Caitlin Langerak after he fell in love with Mary Sue. His preferences are retro and romance music. He dislikes alternative carnival beats and blues. He likes comedy and fitness, but he dislikes rocket science and handiness. He likes potty humor, but he dislikes discussing hobby. Don't freaking tell me about your boring ass hobbies. I don't want to hear that shit. <laughs> and uh, he likes egotistical sims, but he dislikes pessimistic sims. He likes orange and blue, and he dislikes green and black. So that is pretty much Daniel in a nutshell. His lifetime want is to woohoo with 30 different sims. Okay, and then we have Mary Sue, of course. She's over here in her... Is that her winter wear? I need to update everybody's winter outfits because I only had base game when I was creating this save. And I need to give them all better winter outfits. Um, her lifetime want is to have a home worth 400,000 simoleons. Right now it's worth 75,000, so they got a long way to go. <laughs> she, uh, she works as a campaign intern, which is level... I don't know what level that is. I think it's level two. Uh, in the political career. And, oh, Daniel works as an all-star in the athletic career. Oh, he's level eight. And Mary Sue is level two. Okay. Mary Sue, she is materialistic. She's ambitious. She's outgoing. She's insensitive. She has negative empathy. <laughs> she's a fortune sim. She has a music and dance hobby. She would be happy to have a child. Ooh. Um, we gotta, I always like for them to have a son, and she's got 15 days until she becomes an elder, so there is a chance if she and Daniel can patch things up. She's business savvy, she's a sage, and a jester. And her, of course, she got a job, uh, first promotion, woohoo, had her babies, she has a degree in communications, and, uh, yeah, those, those are her milestones, got married, fell in love, all that. 
Um, oh my god, that's awesome. I'm just seeing this now. You can sort by chronological order or milestone type. That is awesome. Okay, and then her likes and dislikes. She likes violin and piano. She loves music. I, I see her too as the type of sim that she probably had like piano lessons when she was a kid and stuff. Hey, hungry cow plant. No more twins. Oh my god, what if she had twins? She only has like two cycles left though. That's right, Hendrick. That's right. You can't just get pregnant anytime when you have wonderful limbs. That is true. So they may not have another child. We'll see. She likes classical music and carnival beats. She dislikes blues and spooky. She likes black and white, dislikes green and gray. She likes optimistic sims, but she dislikes homebody sims. And she likes discussing hobbies and dislikes small talk. So that's... She likes, she dislikes homebody sims. I hate people who stay at home. So that's Mary Sue for you. And then let's take a look at the girls. So Lilith, where are you? Lilith is currently stuck inside of a... I don't know what the hell's going on with Lilith. All right, Lilith, what are you doing? Go here. What? Oh, she was trying to sit down, I guess, when we loaded. She's in her sister's room using the computer. So here's Lilith. I think I did a really good job on her. I really like how she turned out. Quads? No! Um, so her lifetime want is to earn gold on 20 throne parties. She is active, but she's a slob. She's a popularity sim. She has a paranormal hobby. Okay, she is one of the few sims that I changed their hobby in from The Sims 2 to The Sims 4 because she, in The Sims 4, uh, two, she has a sports hobby, which I do not think suits her at all. So I gave her the paranormal hobby because I think that was way more suited to her. And since there wasn't a paranormal hobby in The Sims 2, but there is in The Sims 4 with the mod. Um, she's gregarious. She's a jester. She's a hero. And she has a fear of being judged right now. I know she's me when I was 15 too. And so she fell in love with Dirt Dreamer. She likes mischief and guitar. All right. She dislikes fishing and gardening. She likes alternative and blues. And she dislikes lullabies and spooky. She likes red and black. Dislikes blue and brown. She likes spirited sims, but she dislikes emotional decision makers. She's all cold, hard logic. She wouldn't like me at all. I am an emotional decision maker. Much to the detriment of my life. Um, she likes discussing interests and she dislikes gossip. So that's Lilith. Um, she does not have good manners so far. Um, she's doing all right. And then Angela, she's also wearing her outer wear. So Angela's lifetime want is to have 30 friends. And she is active, good. She's a popularity sim. She has a cuisine hobby. I also changed her hobby to cuisine because I just felt like it made more sense for her. Um, she's gregarious. She's a jester and a hero. And of course, she fell in love with Dustin Broke. And they've already snuck out together once. She likes pop and carnival beats. She dislikes hip hop and kids. She likes gardening and cooking. She dislikes rocket science and video gaming. She likes deception, but she dislikes discussing interests. That's so weird. She likes homebody sims and dislikes funny sims. Don't you dare tell me any jokes. I don't have time for your humor. She likes green and pink and dislikes brown and white. So that is Angela for you. Okay, so now we have to manufacture this whole thing. Let's see. Does Mary Sue go to work today? Um, yeah, she goes to work in two hours, so that's going to be perfect. She gets home at 3 p.m. Oh, no, this, yes, and this is perfect because uh, Daniel is off today. So we can set it up to where he's in bed with Caitlin right about 3 p.m. when Mary Sue comes home. We can make this work. Or we can even make her come home early, I suppose. Um, error, oh, crap. No, I'm dropping frames. No! It is me. It is me, y'all. Okay, it says, please use a keyframe frequency of four seconds or less. Okay. Okay. 
how do I do that? I'm dropping frames really bad. Give me just a second. I'm trying. It's telling me I can. Hold on. It's telling me I can use a keyframe frequency of four seconds or less. So let me see if I can figure out how to do that. I don't know how to do that. I don't even see any options for that. You're not noticing any lag? Okay, well, if it looks normal for you guys, I guess that's fine. Okay, now it's back. All right, now it's back. That was weird. I do, I do think it's me, though. I do think it's me because I'm still having issues on YouTube. Not as badly as on Twitch, but I still think it's me. I think I'm going to have to call my internet people back. But, uh, yeah, that sucks. All right, let me pop out my chat and we'll get back to the game here. Shows my connection is back. Um, I'm only streaming on, on Twitch right now. But you mean, are you asking, Marius, are you asking if I, if I dual stream, how do I know who's from YouTube and Twitch? It'll show me the, it'll, it'll have like, it'll show me in the chat, I think. I can't remember. I haven't done it in a long time. Yeah, it's, I'm the problem. It's me. <laughs> I think it's me. Hey, Jay Blizz. <coughs> Yeah, it seems to be happening on Sundays the most, yeah. No, my PC is fine. I don't think it's my PC. My PC handles all this fine. Um, I do think it's something with my internet connection. I just, I can't figure it out. I never had this problem uh, streaming when I was in Colorado. So it's got to be something to do with my internet here. And I have the best internet available to me in my area. The best, highest speed that you can get here. I even, so after last, like, two weeks ago, I even called to see if I could get fiber, and they still don't have it in my area. Yeah, it looks fine now. Okay. So, what we're going to do is Daniel is going to go, or Daniel's going to stay home today. Mary Sue and the girls are going to go, Mary Sue's going to go to work. The girls are going to go to school. So, let's see. Does anybody have any needs we need to take care of or anything we need to do? She wants to become disliked by Angela. Oh my gosh, Angela will have soon have her first period. <gasps> okay, we have to go to the wonderful store for her. Um, let's see. Go to the wonderful store. And we gotta go get some tampons and stuff for her. Yeah, they don't have, like, I live outside of the city, so they don't have fiber out into my area yet. Who did I just tell to go to the wonderful store? Lilith? I meant Angela. Angela, go to the wonder, I always click the wrong one. Go to the wonderful store. Well, they probably both need to go. I'll get, I'll get a box for both of them. And then, why is Mary Sue sad? Because she is also on her period, and she... Okay, we gotta get three boxes of tampons. We got three women in this house. <laughs> we got three women in the house, so Angela's gonna go to the store and get us all some tampons, okay? One, two, three. Okay, thank you. Let's, let's hand these out. <laughs> no, I do not use teen pregnancy. Um, can I just... Can I just plop these out. I want to put them out. Oh, there's one and there's another. Okay, and you keep the other one for yourself. And then I'll plop these into here. Plop these into here. Have everybody open their boxes so they have what they need. Open box. Open box. Oh, and you also have to unpack box. I don't know why you can't just open it and unpack it. Like, why does it have to be two things? I don't know. Okay, now they all have their tampons, so they're all good. No, I want the periods. I like them having their periods. Uh, okay, Angela and Lilith have to go to school in an hour. Mary Sue is obviously going to work. She wants to... Oh my god, yes! 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 She wants to try for baby with Daniel! Yeah! I mean, she might change her mind after she catches him cheating, though. I'm gonna keep it locked in, though. <laughs> I'm gonna keep it locked in. Uh, when is your next Q&A? You mean on my vlogging channel? Or on the Sims channel? 
Uh, okay, so Daniel, what are you doing with yourself? Freshen up in the mirror. Okay, go freshen up. That's a good idea before you invite your maid over. Oh, and let's see. We need to hire a maid. So let's... What is it? Home? Home. Uh, hire a service. Um, let's see. Yeah, she can't conceive now. We're gonna have to wait till she's off her period. <laughs> Either one, Cindy. I don't care. I love your Q&As. Well, I'm probably gonna do one on my vlogging channel soon. Um, okay. Not a butler. Scheduled maid. I wish I could choose which maid. I feel like there used to be a way you could choose the exact maid you wanted in The Sims 4. Wasn't there... No, it's not that way. It's not that one because that's just to assign them to the role. Well, there was no way to actually, like, choose the maid. I mean, she it, it'll either be Kaylin, Lucy, or Remington. Yeah, it's working better on YouTube, Lampy. No, I'm not confusing it with Squingy's Maid in Sims 2. I feel like there used to be a way, and I did it from the mailbox. And this was a long time ago, years ago. Let's see who he's going to call. Mary Sue, did you go to work? Oh, not yet. It doesn't say. It just says your maid will arrive at 10.05. I guess we're going to find out. <laughs> Hi, Mary. Yeah, I had to move streams because I was having issues streaming on Twitch. You have multiple Sims about to go to school. I'm just going to send them alone for now. When we get to our rotations, we'll go to school with them. But because we're just trying to do the events right now, I'm just going to send them to school alone. Yeah, I'm just going to have... That's exactly right, secondhand. I'm just going to have Daniel invite Kaylin over if we don't get the right maid. We'll get the we'll get the situation down the same anyway. Sandy Broody's the new maid. No. Uh, become disliked by Angela. Okay, so let's check in on Daniel. He wants to move house. No. We're not moving house. He wants to upgrade an object and woohoo in a waterfall. Of course he wants to woohoo in a waterfall. He has a tinkering hobby, so he wants to upgrade something. Maybe we can have him do that with his free time. Um, we can upgrade the sink. He cannot because he has no parts. So can he tinker with something? I forgot. Tinker with the stove? How do we get parts? We have to wait for something to break? Oh, thank you, Annie Shell. Said sent you a pic on Twitter on how to set keyframe. Thank you. Although it quit, that went away. Now it's telling me my connection is fine. But it would still be nice to know how to do that. You can buy it on the PC. Okay, well, he's already on the PC. So let's buy some upgrade parts. Let's see. Uh... Household? No. Web? or oh, order. Order. It's not an... Oh, upgrade parts. Yes. Okay, what should we get? Uh, plumbing upgrade. Let's get like a couple of plumbing upgrades. And a couple of common upgrades eighty three three of each I guess okay now he can upgrade oh, he's working out um I'm just totally not paying any attention to the spring equinox right now we could do that after we get through this all right upgrade to self-cleaning there you go that'll give you something to do Woohoo in a waterfall. <laughs> now, is it 10? Okay, it's not quite 10 yet. I want. I hope the maid shows up because the pizza delivery person never showed up. Whistle stop wimp. The candidate is due to appear on stage at any minute, but they're having a panic attack about their entire- This is so funny! Mary Sue gets a chance card, y'all! What the hell? 
What are the odds of that? That's craziness. Okay, I'm gonna roll for it. So I'm gonna random.org. This is like perfect timing. So should she boost candidate's ego or guilt trip the candidate? And I rolled a 73. So she's gonna guilt trip. And the crowd grows restless and begins booing the candidate, harming the whole campaign. Okay, but like nothing happened from that. And the maid did not show up. So we are having an issue with the maid not showing up. Um, and is that Kayla? No, that's Jennifer Burb. So none of my NPCs are showing up. Is this a bug? I don't have NPCC in here. Does anybody know why this might be happening? Yeah, the pizza delivery person didn't show up. The maid didn't show up. Well, yeah, I'm going to call Kaylin over. But I'm just talking about, in general, this is going to be a problem for the game. If the NPCs don't show up. C. Watkins says, yeah, there's a known bug. Do I have opt-out of fame checked in the settings? I don't think so. Um... No, I do not. So, yeah. It's on the laundry list to be fixed February 27th. Okay. Um, yeah, okay, well, that sucks. That sucks. Is the mailbox accessible? I believe so, yes. Should be. That's only for employees on lots. Uh, Mystery says NPCs show up on my lot, though. I, I can't get any pizza and I can't get any maids. Okay, well, I'm going to have to look into that and see if I can figure out what's causing that um, later. So they need a few more minutes. Well, let's give it a few more minutes then. Let's give it a few more minutes to see if they show up. But the pizza delivery never showed up. No, that's not our maid. I don't think they're coming. It's been like an hour. Oh, upgrade complete. And somebody's calling. Buddies before studies. Lila tried to skip out on class today to comfort a crying friend. What should we tell her? Don't skip class. Education is vital. Yeah, uh, NPC. Oh, there's the flower bunny. Hello, Flower Bunny. I guess I can have Daniel go meet the Flower Bunny. And then we're calling Caitlin over. We gotta hurry up before Mary Sue gets home. Meet the Flower Bunny. Hey, wait. Come back, Flower Bunny. Okay, great. Enough of that. <laughs> Let's call up Ka uh, Caitlin. If I can talk. And invite to hang out at Current Lot. We got to get these two in bed together by 3 p.m. <laughs> yes, I am. I do plan to make a video about Life by You very soon. Uh, probably next week I'm going to make one. That's the pizza bunny. I wish. Okay, here comes Kaylin. So let's go ahead and start. What's he upset about? Oh, he doesn't like the... He doesn't like the flower bunny. All right, let's greet... Let's do a flirty introduction with Kaylin. Hey, flirty introduction. Come on, let's go. All right, and um, let's just get flirty here. She's wearing her horrible outerwear. Oh, he dis... Oh, he dislikes- Oh, he dislikes handiness? Oh, hold on. We gotta fix this. Um. What am I trying to do here? It was because I made him do handiness. And he dislikes handiness, but that's his hobby. You know what? We should change his hobby to make it make sense. Because in The Sims 2, hobbies were based on their personality points. And it didn't really always make sense to me. So I think I'm going to change his hobby. Let's give him. Can I remove a trait? Hold on. I think I can. 
The tinkering hobby just really doesn't make sense. I think he should have a sports hobby. Cheating is his hobby. I'm giving him sports. Okay. That just makes more sense to me. All right. And now he doesn't have to be handy anymore. Okay, he's getting flirty. Who's this? I like seeing my townies. Randy London is walking by. Hey, Randy. There's uh, Dustin Broke. Oh my gosh, Dustin. Uh, Daniel hates Dustin. And Dustin, you should be in school. Why are you not in school? And you too, Randy. You bunch of skippers. <laughs> okay, they're getting, uh, they're getting flirty, so this is good. We've got about two hours and 45 minutes. So I wonder if I can have them sit and chat on the bed. You want to come sit and chat on my bed? You know where this is going to lead to. I'm just going to have them sit and chat for a little while. I'm going to try and have them woohoo right about the time Mary Sue comes home. Oh yeah, I don't do teen pregnancies because my sims, they got enough time for pregnancies. I want to let them have their teen years. <laughs> where are you going? Get back here, Kaylin. Get back here. And also, let's change her into her regular clothes. I don't want, I, I don't like those clothes. <laughs> change outfit every day. Okay. Um, come back and talk to her. Call over. I don't know where she's going. Come back! Does teen pregnancy in Sims 3... I don't... Do I do teen pregnancy in Sims 3? Did I do teen pregnancy in Sims 3? Oh, yeah, I did. Oh, yeah, I remember. I was doing teen pregnancy in Sims 3. Yes, I do remember that. Um, I typically don't like to do teen pregnancy, though. Not in Sims 2 or Sims 4. So, Daniel, you need to be making some moves here. Do a pickup line or something. <laughs> oh, that's true, Sammy. If I stream on YouTube, the people who watch the replay back can see the chat. Yeah, they can see what I'm laughing at. <laughs> uh, ooh la la. Daniel likes flirtation. Yes. Yes, he does. That's a given. Of course he likes flirtation. Okay, it's 1.15. Let's do a little flirt. Get back here, Kaylin. Where are you going? Where does she keep going? Maybe she has to use the bathroom or something. I don't know. She keeps leaving. No, don't go upstairs. No, no. Don't go upstairs. The sim is too far away to call over. Oh my god. Hold up. I think I have, um, I have control any sim, but now I don't remember how to use it. How do I control her? Is it under actions? Oh, let's form group. Let's form group with her. Yeah, she's trying to use the PC. I know that's what she's doing. Let's lock let's lock the door. Let's lock the door for everybody but Angela to her room. Lock for everyone but Angela. Okay. Cuz everybody's going to keep trying to go in her room and it's so annoying. Okay, Daniel, um, let's try this again. We've got an hour and a half. Sit together on the bed. Get down here, Kaylin. No, where is she? She's not cooperate. How did she get in there? Oh, how did she get in there? If I lock the door. Oh my god. This is so annoying. They do need to have a first kiss. Okay, he's just gonna go up here and... They're making it difficult. First kiss. I'm just gonna see if we can make this happen. He's not gonna be able to get in there. Kaylin, come out here! 
Can now she can she not get out? Oh my god. Unlock. Unlock. Okay. Now <laughs> <coughs> How did she get in there with the door locked? Is because she was already going in there? Yeah, we'll lock the PC. Lock computer for everyone but Angela. Okay, great. Now get in here and kiss your mistress in your daughter's bedroom. Romance, physical intimacy, first kiss. Do not watch TV. We've got less than an hour. Come on. Get it together! Okay, here we go. It's annoying trying to orchestrate this, but we're gonna make it happen. We're barely gonna make it happen. <laughs> Hydrate! Thank you, Arp Deco! <laughs> I'll let you redeem that Hydrate on YouTube. <laughs> Okay, yeah, so they had their first kiss, so now it's time. They've got, like, 40 minutes we gotta kill. So, let's go relax together on the bed. Go relax together. This is what I usually have them do in The Sims 2, and then we wait for Mary Sue to get home, and don't you dare get up! Don't get up! What is wrong with you? Stop it! Stop it! Oh my god. Relax together again. Caitlin, why will you not cooperate with my plan to seduce you? Relax together. Oh, she wanted to light the fireplace. Aww. Oh, Daniel's been removed from the Pleasant View Tinkerers Club because he no longer- Oh, yeah, I forgot. I put him in the Tinkerers Club. He needs to go in the sports club with Nina now. Oh, Mary Sue's home. She brought home 266 simoleons. Okay, great. The girls are home from school. Okay, here we go. Let's... Woohoo with Kaylin Langerak. And where is Mary Sue? Okay, let's have Mary Sue come and go here. All right, here we go. The time has come. I hope this is gonna work out. Her- oh, no. Mary Sue might come in too early. I might have to stop her. Come on! Oh no, the girls are coming in. Here comes Mary Sue! Oh, 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 wait just a second, Mary Sue. Wait just a second. She's gonna stand outside the door like, what is that noise? What is that noise? Okay, now go here. Oh god, here we go. Here it comes! Do you see what's happening, Mary Sue? New personality trait! She's got a new personality trait. Mary Sue was cheated on by someone she cared for is in a jealous rage. Yes! She's jealous now. Okay, you're not acting like you're in a jealous rage, Mary Sue. You, what? This is her jealous rage face? This is... This is... She should be acting way more upset, I feel like. She's going to make coffee? What the hell is wrong with you, Mary Sue? She's not a jealous- Go back in there! This is- So this is where Sims 4 gets me, right here. The look on her face is- That is not- I see my husband literally sleeping with another woman before my eyes. She- she's smiling! She's gonna go make coffee! Look how happy she is! She's taking it well! Um, she has the jealous rage, like, moodlets and stuff- No! Yeah, maybe it's her moodlets. But she doesn't even have any- What? Don't take a nap! Get back here! I'm gonna make you acknowledge this. You were in- She's in denial, y'all! She's in full denial! Get over here! Just be standing there when they get out of bed. Mary Sue's like, this is fine. Just be standing there when they get out of bed. Okay. 
Now, what do you what are you gonna what do you have to say for yourself? Talk about marriage? Yeah, a shove. Okay, at least we have to try to stay complain about love life. What can we do here? Divorce? I don't want them to get divorced yet. Shout forbidden words at him. At least do something, man. Yeah, that's the murderous smile. At least we can simulate her getting mad here. Oh my god. Mary Sue and Daniel have a difficult family dynamic. Uh, yeah, I would say so. I would say so. I don't think she could slap him. I was trying to do the, the Sims 2 slap, but I don't think it was available. Malicious. She can shove. And let's look at their relationship now. Did their relationship change? Oh yeah, she's super pissed at him and she hates Kaylin. Wait, the maid the maid didn't come though. We just got charged for the maid, but the maid didn't come. What the hell was that about? Yeah, maybe we need meaningful stories after all, because she should not be happy. Maybe I do need meaningful stories, because this is not, like, she's not happy. She's obviously very upset, but she, but this is showing happy. See, this is where The Sims 4 loses me. This is where I get upset about The Sims 4, and this is what, it's the sucky-ass emotion system. It sucks. I think I'm gonna have to reinstall, um meaningful stories just so my sims will like actually feel what they're supposed to feel she should not be happy about a painting in a fucking fireplace when she just caught her husband sleeping with the maid you know oh and she needs to go she needs to go tell her off too rude introduction i'm daniel's wife yeah i can't i will cancel out the happy moodlets because i think it's bs um, but now she's fine? No, she's not fine. She's- this should overpower. See? That sucks. Um, okay, we're just- yeah, we're just gonna have to cheat. Because no- Now she's dazed from her period. Okay, that's cool. Now she's angry! All right, I guess that's what I'm gonna have to do when I when I feel like a sim should feel a certain way. We're just gonna cancel all that BS out. <sighs> this is the thing that like I would enjoy Sims Four if it weren't for this. Okay, finally she's angry, and now she can chew out. So let's chew him out. She's gonna chew him out. Sorry, I am dropping frames again. I know, it's lagging. I see my connection. Sorry. Did she just flirt with him? Okay, she, Kaylin needs to leave. Yell out for sleeping with your partner. Okay, thank you. I guess I'm just gonna have to get used to manipulating the moodlets when I need to because um, I, she needs to be angry right now. <coughs> <clears throat> Sorry, y'all. I'll give it just a second and see. Uh, last time I was dropping frames, it came back. So, obviously, it's not just Twitch that I'm having a problem with. Obviously, it is my internet connection somehow. So, yeah, I'm going to call back my um, internet company on Monday, tomorrow, and tell them I need them to come out again and look at it because I'm s still having the same issues. I know. I love Mary Sue's moodlet with sanitary products. Like, yeah, after a long day at work, I also think of my tan packs. Makes me so happy. <sighs> I'm giving it just a second, y'all, to see if it, it comes back. But I was going to have her yell at... She's going to yell at for sleeping with your partner. 
Come on. Okay, finally! She's yelling at Kaylin for sleeping with her partner. Alright, now... Uh, Kaylin needs to leave. So, can we... Do not apologize. Send her home. Get out of here. So we have, we're going to have to repair this relationship if she wants to have another baby. I don't even know if that's going to be possible. Okay, stream's back. Stream's back. Um, no, it does, the jealous trait does not replace other traits. They get an additional trait. Yeah. Okay, so Mary Sue's really pissed off about that, which she should be. And Daniel's in here. I don't know what he's doing. Getting a sandwich. Eating a corn dog. He's just like, yeah, that's cool. I'm gonna go have a corn dog. Okay. Um, I don't think meaningful stories conflicts with anything that anything that I use. Yeah. Well, my husband just cheated on me, but at least my tampons are working well. <laughs> okay. So you know, I'm gonna let her sit in there and, and stew. She's also gonna oh. Angela's coming to ask her some advice, like, Hey, Mom, uh, sorry Dad cheated on you, but I need some life advice right now. <laughs> the football team sports day is starting. I feel like Daniel would want to go to that, but... I'm not sure what I want to be when I grow up, and all my friends seem to have it figured out. How do I figure it out myself? I only have... I hate it when it only gives you one option. Pick something you like. Hey, Spencer! Um, I don't use hair replacements in The Sims 4, no. Okay, well, um, let's go ahead and, and see how our girls are doing. What are you doing out here? Oh, Lilith is out here doing mischief. Look, just look at her. She's mischievous. <laughs> look at that mischievous face. Okay, so let's have her clean up the mess that she just made. Come on. Oh, new di family dynamic jokesters. Lilith and Herb are jokesters. Oh, I love that. Lilith is get Lilith is has little family jokes with her grandpa Herb. I love that. Okay, yes. Aww. <laughs> That's grandpa. I love that they have a little relationship going on there. Herb and Lilith. Okay, she's going to cook something to eat. Cook a tortilla-wrapped veggie dog. <laughs> oh, it's the parenting skill, I see. Yeah, it's the parenting skill. Yeah, I don't think Mary Sue has much of a... I don't think she has any parenting skills. Aw, thank you, uh, Lee Spillet Sim. You can make your own tortilla wrapped veggie dog or whatever the hell you were making. Oh yeah, I need to have uh, Mary Sue invite Cassandra over. You're right, you're right. She's making some coffee and then she'll invite Cassandra over. Uh, let's see. Invite over. Oh, is she already here? Because I can't invite her to hang out at current lot. She must be out here somewhere. I'll have to wait a second. All right, Mary Sue's making some coffee. Lilith is cooking herself some food. Let's check on Angela. Angela's angry because she's on her period. She's also hungry. Come get some food and calm down. She's going to join cooking with Lilith. <coughs> yeah, but you need to, like, make your own food now. So go grab a drink. No, get Food. Food. I, I, I did auto-solve on hunger and she got coffee. Alright, cool, I guess. If that's what you want, you want coffee for dinner. Alright, let's uh, see if we can invite Cassandra over yet. She must be out there somewhere. Let's see, she must be in this neighborhood somewhere. Let's see if we can find her. That's not her. Is she over here? Nope. Where are you? Where are you, Cassandra? Is she fishing? No, that's Nina. 
Hmm. I don't see her anywhere. Is she in this little park? Nope, Brandy Broke is over there. <clears throat> I don't know where she is, y'all. That's Jennifer Burb. Hmm. I guess I'll just wait a few more minutes. She might be at work, that's true. She might be at work. Okay, we'll have to wait a few minutes. Uh, Mary Sue's gonna drink her coffee, go take a bath, go take a bathroom break. And Angela, you really need to get yourself some food. No, not coffee. I guess I'm gonna have to direct you to do it yourself. Cook. So her hobby is cuisine, so she likes to cook anyway. So let's have her cook some... Um, let's see. I don't know. I don't know. There's so many options. BLT. Go ahead and make a family size so there'll be leftovers left. I feel like Angela would do most of the cooking for the family. Oh, I can't play Sims 4 without mods either. Must have mods. And still, it's not perfect, like, the whole situation where Mary Sue was not angry when she should have been because of all the happiness, it, um, emotions. The emotion system sucks. It needs, it needs help. Yeah, I didn't get a cheating moodlet. I don't know why I get that cat. It sh I should have. Um, I have relationship and pregnancy overhaul. Yeah, that's one of my must-have mods. School is stupid. I should be able to start working or living life. Can I never go to school again? No, you have to go to school. Lilith wants to drop out of school. Your Nina Caliente just had a baby girl. Aww. Okay, you need to eat. And chat with your mom. And then let's check in on Daniel. I don't even know what he's even doing over here. He had an aggravating conversation about getting uh, caught cheating. <clears throat> so let's see. He wants to move house. We can't do that. He wants to mediate the forums. And he wants to woohoo in a waterfall. So really the only thing he can do is mediate the forums. But I locked the computer to him. So maybe I can get them like a laptop to put downstairs. Let's see. Yeah, I agree with that, Sun Me. The motion systems is like a good idea that was never ever play tested or fixed. Yeah, it the tuning is bad. <clears throat> it could work well, but the tuning is just so bad. I think I'm gonna give meaningful stories another try. Because it does fix some of that. Um, okay, so let's see. I wanted to buy a laptop for downstairs. Oh, it's the slablet is a thousand. This one is a thousand. They don't have that much money. But Daniel makes a lot of money, so whatever. They're gonna get it. They're gonna get it. Wait, turn this way. Turn this way. There we go. Um, okay, now Daniel, now you have a computer that you can play on. So get over here and is it social? No, it should be under web, I think. Where is it? Web? Nope. Is it under... What's it under? Hold on. Social network? No, I already checked that. Where is it? Socialize? Yeah, socialize. Okay. <clears throat> Sometimes I have the hardest times trying to find things in the menus. Okay, now let's check. Lilith, what do you want to be doing with yourself? Um, you want to go to the gym, work on a project sloppily, or meet, an meet another vampire from Paranormal Hobby? Oh my god. I can see Lilith becoming a supernatural here. I re removed Meaningful Stories because I felt like it made some of the emotions too powerful, but I haven't used it in a long time, so I'm sure it's probably been improved. So yeah, I'm going to try it again. We'll try it in the next stream. Um, okay, so I think I'm going to have her work on her project sloppily. Oh, she doesn't have a project to work on. Okay. Um, 
she could travel. Well, it's already 7 11 p.m. I'm just going to let her do what she wants. And uh, Angela, take a selfie. All right, let's take a selfie. Uh -huh. oh, yeah. <laughs> take a selfie and post that on your Instagram. And this is really, I really only play them just to get this, um, this scenario out of the way. So now we're pretty much ready to start our regular rotations of four days each for each, each household. There's a selfie. Now post it, post it on your, on your Instagram. She wants to tease Lilith, have a water balloon fight, and be friendly with a non-household sim. Ooh, Forgotten Hollow for the track hose. That's a great idea, Nathan. That's a great idea. Um, okay, let's tease Lilith. Uh, let's see. Is it under mean or mischief? Where's tease? Maybe it's under mischief? Pranks? Tease. Tease about bravery? Um, the fourth wish is a mod. Is, I th I'm pretty sure that's from the... Uh, I'm pretty sure that's from a mod, yeah. But she does have a fear of being judged, which is... The fears are part of the game. Figure out differences with other sims. Are they getting along now? Wow. Figure out differences with? Okay, can she figure out differences with her sister? Let's see. Where would that even be? I don't even know. Yeah, they got a positive boost from that. Select two different sims and click the figure out differences under the friendly category. Okay, it's under friendly? Okay, but where? Where? You don't tell me where. Small talk? No? Intra oh, it's not interest. Deep thoughts? Oh, it's under deep thoughts. Okay, figure out differences. Wow. Let's see if they can figure out their differences. The healing. The healing. Did that work? Yes! Okay, let's check on their uh, relationship. It's it's getting a little bit better. Alright. <clears throat> okay, so... Um, here comes the flower bunny. So anyway, I guess um, we're pretty much done with this family. I guess I'll just play them through the rest of the night, though. And then I will have to sync up everybody's ages when we go through the rounds. I'm just going to... Basically, what I'm going to do right now is I'm just going to start playing everybody for four days. Whatever their ages are right now, like, it's fine. I think Dustin will be a little bit older because we ended up playing that family longer. Yeah, YouTube is working better, Flo. I'm still having some issues, but it is working better. Okay, who else can she figure out differences with? She doesn't really have any... Maybe her mom? Let's have her go figure out differences with her mom. Uh, oh wait, that was right there. Figure out differences. Hello, Flower Bunny. I've been completely ignoring the fact that it's a holiday. Um, I've never... No, I've never played the Ancestors of the Pre-Maids in The Sims 2. <clears throat> I've thought about it, but I've never actually gone through with it. I played the Broke family for five days. Um, I gotta think about what I'm gonna do. Maybe I'll play everybody for seven days in the beginning. And so when I go back to the Broke family, I'll just play them for... I should have written down how long I played every family. But I think everybody I only played for one day except for the Broke family. I think that's right. No, Dawn, yeah, Dawn I played for one day. Yeah, everybody I played for one day except for the Broke family. 
<clears throat> so yeah. I'll, uh, maybe I'll play everybody for seven days and we'll just play the Broke family for two days or something. I'll figure it out. We'll get them synced back up mostly. Close enough. Because I don't really, so in The Sims 4, I don't really keep up with their ages by day like I do in The Sims 2. Like, I, I don't do a one-to-one -one ratio where one day is one, um year. I don't do that in The Sims 4 because they have a longer lifespan with the young adult and the adult and everything and it just, it would be, their lives would be too short I think. So it doesn't really matter if their ages are a little bit out of sync from what they were in The Sims 2. As long as they're as long as they all go to college together to me it's fine. I played the Brokes for three. Okay, then that's fine. I think I'm just gonna go ahead and just start playing everybody for four days and whatever their ages are is fine. I'll send all the kids to college together that need to go together and it'll be fine. Okay. So. Yeah. I think it'll be, I think it'll work out fine. They'll still be close enough to the same age that they can go to college together. And I'm not going to worry so much about the, about the one-to-one -one aging uh, and sinking in The Sims 4 as I do in The Sims 2. You're an hour late, but rewatching later too. <laughs> Hello, cupcake attack. I'm just trying to get the pleasants through tonight. Uh, Daniel, Daniel's taking a nap. Okay, wake up, Daniel. Wake up. It's not bedtime yet. You don't go to bed until I say. He still wants to do the same things. He wants to flirt with someone. Let's go have him try to flirt with Mary Sue and see if she's receptive. Um, let's see. Blow a kiss, maybe. Mary Sue, she's really tired, though. She's going to have to go to sleep. She still wants to try for a baby because I locked it in, damn it. And she wants to complete a work task because she's a workaholic. Uh, Lilith, she's going to bed. She's like, good night. I'm going to bed, y'all. All right, Lilith. Sleep tight. <laughs> and then Angela, she's not really tired yet. So what can she do? Be friendly with a non-household sim, have a water balloon fight, and cook an excellent meal. It looks like she's... Dirk is outside? Is she going to talk to Dirk? <clears throat> Lilith, Angela's going to talk to your boyfriend outside. Try for a baby with someone else. No! I want them to have a son. I'd like there to be a pleasant, a male heir to the pleasant, to the pleasant household. Okay, so she's... What? We're, okay, you're trying to talk to Dirk, but I guess he's gone? Because... Alright, that's cool. Uh, she wants to cook an excellent meal, have a water balloon fight, be friendly to a non-household sim. Well, let's go talk to somebody out here, then. Who's this? Oh, look, there's Dustin. Go be friendly to him. Um, let's be friendly... Um, go give him a hug. Perfect. That sim is irresistible. Angela has a major crush on Dustin. I know she does. I don't know where she was going. Now she wants to go swimming. I'm kind of focusing on her because everybody else is kind of ready for bed, but she's she wants to go swimming. I guess she could, uh, she's going to invite Dustin over to go swimming. I think she would definitely be doing that. And then while they do that, while they make their way over there, let's check in on Daniel and Mary Sue and see how things are going here. Put these leftovers in the fridge. Mary Sue, what are you doing? Oh, she's waiting. She's trying to kiss Daniel's neck. Okay, she is. I guess she's trying to make things better between them. Aww. She's a lover. She's a lover. <laughs> Okay, let's check on their relationship. It's, um, wait, where is she? It's still not great. It's still not great. She's, how are we even family? Oh, he wants to chat with Lilith, but she's in bed. Okay, so Mary Sue, she really needs to go to bed. She is super tired, so I'm going to have her go to bed. I just ignored the spring equinox. We didn't have time for that today. It was a rough day in the Pleasant family. I'm going to send Daniel to bed too. And then we'll watch Angela and Dustin swim around for a little bit. 
Yes. Yeah, so next week's Pleasant View stream on next Sunday, we're going to be starting round one with the, um, with Dawn and Cassandra. So we'll be starting Dawn and Cassandra, which means we'll probably be having a baby. I hope so. She's like, I'm better than that maid. Oh yeah. <laughs> the bunny's just like, somebody please pay attention to me. Nobody cares. Okay. She's freezing. She's got to get out. Oh my God. She's freezing cold. She's got to get out of the water. Stop swimming. Get out. Come inside. Come inside. Oh my god. She's freezing to death. Get in here. Get in here. Whew. Okay. That was not good. Uh, she's gotta go to bed now, though. Go warm up in bed. Sleep. <laughs> Pools are not heated in The Sims 4, no. She didn't even say goodbye to Dustin. She was just like, I'm out of here. See you later. She didn't, she didn't say anything. Okay, so that's the Pleasant family. And let's get, let's go ahead and go till morning time. So yeah, we'll be starting uh, playing Dawn and Cassandra. I'm going to play all, all of the families for four days. And so we have all the scripted events done. Now the burbs and oldies, normally in The Sims 2, the next thing I would do is move in the burbs and oldies, but I've already done that. They're, they're already moved into their houses. So we don't have to do anything with them. No, I'm not recreating my Pleasant View Let's Play. I'm just doing the scripted events. And then now I'm just going to let whatever happens, happens in this Ple in the Pleasant View in The Sims 4. So if the, some of the same things will probably happen and probably a lot of things will be different. Yeah, she almost died there. The spring Equinox was awful. I know it was. I'm sorry. Sorry. No, I'm not going to change. I'm not going to choose the same baby names. Probably not. It, it depends. Oh, if you have that geothermal house trait, the pools will be heated. Oh, yeah. Maybe I should have given them that. Yeah, I always start Pleasant View exactly the same way and then it goes in a different direction. Yes, that's right. I'm trying to get to like 6 a.m. before I save. The realistic childbirth mod. Okay, I will check that out. So you guys have given me a lot of mods to check out. I need to make a little list here. So I already have Milestones mod on my list. I have, um, let's see, let me add the realistic childbirth. I'm going to try um, Meaningful Stories again. And what was the other one somebody mentioned? Pray for no flop house flu. Yeah. <laughs> somebody mentioned another one. I can't remember what it was now. Oh, better pie menu. That's right. Better pie menu. Okay. All right, so I will get all of those before um, our next stream. Almost 6 a.m. Come on, come on. Oh, who's awake? Lilith, you're awake at 5 a.m.? Oh, she was about to pee her pants, probably. Um, she needs to take a bath, too. Go ahead and take a bath. No, not extreme violence, no. Oh, and I need to look into the NPC thing. Why are my NPCs not showing up? I don't think it has anything to do with NPCC because I took that out. NPCs not showing up. Let me see if I can look into that and figure out if it's like if I'm having a mod conflict or what. Oh yeah, and Wims Overhaul. Thank you, Nathan. I'm going to look into getting Wims Overhaul too. All right. Okay. So let me check it on those. Come on, 6 a.m. And then so I'm, I'm saving at 6 a.m. because that's when I switch households. Okay, perfect. All right, let's save here. So this is going to be the end of today's stream. Like I said, if you uh, missed it, there is going to be a part one of the stream where we played the Dreamers. Um, once it finishes processing from Twitch, I'll upload it to this channel. And then I will also have this one available. Um, a playback for this one available soon, too. Because it's going to go unlisted after the stream's over. Uh, but it shouldn't still affect them if I take NPCC out, I wouldn't think. No, I don't have the private dwelling lot, no. 
No, I forgot to set the sinks. I need to set the sinks in everybody's houses. Character values overhaul. Okay, let me look into that one too. That sounds good, Hendrick. Character values overhaul. Okay. Thank you. Hey, Emily. Well, you just caught me right at the end of the stream. It's just about to end. <laughs> I would never do the extreme violence mod. I just don't play that way, you know? I have never created my real life. Well, I have created a once or twice. I created like my roommates one time and then I created like me and my ex-husband one time, but I never play with myself in The Sims. Yeah, I've heard conflicting advice on that, Alice. Some people say Wim's overhaul conflicts with Missy Hissy's hopes and fears and some people say they use them together and don't have any problems, so I don't know. Aw, oh, thank you, R. Baker. I do- oh yeah, w Wonderful Whims is one of my must-have. Must-have mods. <laughs> I never- you know what I mean! I never play myself as a sim. <laughs> you know what I mean, guys. All right, y'all. So yeah, I'm going to wrap up the stream here. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I'm going to get my internet service provider out here again to look at my hookups and replace some more stuff and hopefully that can fix some of the issues I'm having. Uh, if not, I will try to get like dual streaming going so I can stream on both YouTube and Twitch at the same time. And I don't know, we'll figure it out. Thank you for sticking in there with me though. I really appreciate you guys watching. And um, yes, it was fun. And I will see you guys, um, let's see, on Friday for Sims 4 Random Legacy Challenge. <laughs> Have a great rest of your weekend, guys. I'll see you soon. Ma'am, this is a family stream. Sorry! <laughs> Actually, it's really not. It's really not. <laughs> Bye, guys. Bye, Lodane.